to upload your presentation to the discussion board, first go to wherever you have saved your presentation. It will be the full presentation, not just this one. This one's one that I did in class when we were just getting started. First, you need to save the presentation to your computer. So click File, Save As, and then download a copy. You can download as a PDF if you need to, but downloading as PPTX or PowerPoint, the standard way that Office 365 will download your content is pptx i believe if you have a mac the safer way may be to save as a pdf then go back to your content once you've saved it click on the link where it says click here to upload then you're in the discussion board so click on the correct discussion then click create thread then you can browse local files and then you can upload your content to don't forget to hit submit so i just browsed local file opened oops a value must be provided oh in the subject line you will put your act and scene so i did act one scene one That will help your classmates know what they are reviewing, if they have a specific scene they would like to review. Then click Submit. And then it will be there. Um, once you have uploaded yours, you can see everyone else's. Um, your content will be graded in the discussion board. I have actually given you more than one place to upload just to make sure that you can find it. Um, so any of the red links you see, those are major assignments. So don't miss those. Know that those are places to click to upload. I've also put a module for presentations here. So I can click this red link as well. I might see a page that looks like this. Create thread. It says join the conversation by creating a thread. That's what you're doing. And then don't forget your subject, whatever act and scene you're doing. And maybe your character as well. Then browse local files wherever you saved it. Open and submit. Where did it go? There it is. That's it. And then you can check for your content. Check in my grades. See if it's there. If you have a yellow circle with an exclamation point, that means you have correctly uploaded. If you have a partial blue circle, you have not finished uploading. Also, you can view the rubric in My Grades. So you can see where you will get points and what for. So you can see all of the components for your assignment by looking at the rubrics every time. So you don't have to wonder what each slide will will be worth and what each component will be worth. It's there for you.